Welcome to my ultimate shipbuilding guide. Now before we start, I'm going to let you know off rip that you definitely need an outpost with a landing platform with a builder attached to it. Right? Because we're going to get down and dirty. We're going to do a C-class build. If you're not up to the C class yet, just get try to save and get the best that you can possibly get for the class that you're in. And if you watched my last video, I gave you a great money making opportunity. And I don't think it's going to get patched anytime soon. So enjoy. But back to the ultimate ship build. For me right now, this is my ultimate ship. This is my aphid. Um, but we're going to build another ship. So what I like to do is I like to start at my platform because it gives you the largest variety of, of equipment that you could apply to your ships. Now, acquire a, sh uh, a ship that you can that you have no kinship to that you could just destroy and ruin and for me it's going to be this one right here the ecliptic falcata 3 gonna destroy it gonna ruin it gonna get it up out of here so we go to our ship building. select all delete now this might be a little bit expensive. So first, we're going to get ourselves our reactor. C-class all the way. So we're gonna go for the reactor that is giving us the most power, the highest repair rate, largest health, and power generated. Uh, power generated is the number that you wanna look at mostly. So 40. 40 is it. All right. Next, we're going to get ourselves a shield. Now, I know there's a 1600 in here, so there's a shield. Next, we're going to get our grav drive. And again, this is the ball out. This is the ball out version. But we're going to try to keep. You'll see. You'll see. So we've got our grab drive. We've got our grab drive. Got our reactor. And now we're going to have to go and get ourselves some fuel tanks. All right? Uh, I like this one. The H40 Atlas. And I like it so much, I usually get two of those. Right? So next, we're gonna grab ourselves a cock, a docker. Well, yeah, we're gonna, we might as well get the docker out of the way. That one's gonna go on the bottom, right? Now we want a cockpit. For now, we can just throw anything on, being mindful that we're gonna go elsewhere and modify our ship a little bit more, a little bit more. So, we'll keep this one for now, right? Now, you have to know that the habs that you need that are necessary, that are absolutely necessary, you're gonna want an all-in-one, right? So you can sleep. You're gonna want a workshop. So you could do repairs on your suits, upgrades to your suits, especially your weapons early in the game. You're going to want an infirmary because that's going to give you um, the pharmaceutical lab and then you want a control station. That's going to give you crew stations so you could have members 
of your crew on board. Uh, we'll make it like that. Okay, um, we're also going to need a docker. Uh, actually, we're going to need, sorry, we're going to need uh, a land, a bay. Um, I prefer a bay with no ladder, where you could just walk in, and let me see, can we rotate this thing? Okay, that's just, that's the limit of what we can do. What other doctors we got going on here? Yeah, okay, this one is good. So we'll take this one and we'll flip it around. We'll throw that in the back. And we're just gonna lift everything up. We're gonna lift this up. Whoops. Lift that up. Lift that up. Lift that up. Lift that up. Put that back down. Alright. So we just want the bare necessities on this thing. For now. We'll dress it up a little bit later. Get that on there. that on there. Get that on there. We get the shield on. Somewhere there. And our docker. We flip that around. And we stick it on the bottom of something. which is landing gear which is more than likely the landing gear we have no landing gear let's get some landing gear uh, so the gear that we want Symmetry. There we go. There we go. No, that's not the land. this here. Duplicate 
that and shift duplicate that shift duplicate that that we have now possibly just the weapons two oh the and the engines we have no engines on this and we haven't we haven't placed our cargo yet but this is only part one this is only part one this is getting the, the just the fundamentals, the route down, so we can go to the next location and then we can really hook it up properly, proper line. All right. So we're gonna throw some weapons on here. Oops. We're gonna throw some weapons on here. Now we want to get this right now because where we're going may not have. The weapons that we want so we want to get this right from right now um, I'm going with the alpha turret ourselves a really good missile launcher that there that there maybe stick one on the bottom can we do that yep we can do that oh no we can't do that get one more and we're gonna make it maybe a gauss gun balling out right balling out so a gauss gun there a gauss gun there How do we want our engines mounted onto this? So me, as you can see, I, I go all the way to the bottom to see what we got down here. See what we really working with here. We got one of these. All right, we're gonna have to build. We have to build something for our engine over here. This, on this thing, somewhere, somewhere we're gonna have to have an engine build. Let's see, do we have enough engines? Oh no, I, I, I believe we're good. Nominal. We are good. We have mobility of 100, and that's because we ain't throw a piece of cargo on here yet. And that's what's coming up next. We gotta place our cargo now. Now we go down. And we go find the, the biggest, baddest cargo that we could find in here, which I believe is this one right there. 
biggest, baddest cargo. And we won. Like, logically, like there, there, there really shouldn't be much logic when it comes to this, this part, right? do see because we we just want we want the bare minimum of everything so we got the habs that we need so now we're going into our structural and we got to get something that's gonna it's gonna be able to, to help us hold up our our engine right there right so we got the Hope Tech pipes here. Throw that one there. And we got the Hope Tech mid pipe there. Right? And now we can do this. And we can throw that thing up there. Right? And then what we do is we get one of them engine struts. And we throw that thing right there. I guess, uh, I guess you just leave that. Leave that one right there. And there we go. What's the error now? What's the error now? Too few landing gears. Reduce mass. Alright, I think we could possibly. Now we go to the A class engine. Is it me? Is it me? Is it me? Too much power for engines now. Okay, I think we're at the max for the engine power. Now we gotta get rid of this. Reduce mass. We've got too few landing gears. Well, that's not, that's, that's not a real problem. Because we just go do that. We just go do that. Now, always add a landing gear here and there. Too few landing gears still. Alright, we're going to have to live without one of these things. Still too few landing gears. Um, we're gonna have to do a little bit of structural magic here. A little structural magic. We gotta go up in here in our gears.
everything is. get our mobility back up so we don't have to live with that amount well since minimalist is what we are still going for currently is what we're gonna do it ain't gonna be pretty we never said we was trying to make a pretty Pretty shit. Alright? We just want the most functional shit. given so in the next episode what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this elsewhere and we're gonna hook it up because we done spend five hundred thousand dollars on this bad boy and i promise you it is a thing to behold it's gonna be a beast and we're gonna check that out in the next episode too thanks for rocking with me we about out of here